Hard Hop is made by FlexiBits, the same gang that brought you Fantastical. So of course Card Hop is going to have an amazing all-in-one parser field. Let's play with that a little bit. Let's say I got a telephone call from an old college friend, Angus McMillan, and uh, I'm going to add him to my contacts database through Card Hop. All I have to do is tap on Card Hop in the menu bar and then type in his name, Angus McMillan. And while we're on the phone, he tells me that he's got a new telephone number. It's 949-555-1212. And you can see while I'm doing this, it's automatically parsing the name and the telephone number right out of this field here. But I want to get more information from Angus. Let's say he's got an email address, angus at bigangusm.com. Cardhop can figure that out too. And finally, because Angus is a friend, I want to add him to my friends list. So I'm going to hit the pound sign and then type friends. And you can see it automatically figures out that he goes in my friends list. So if I hit the return key now, it's going to add Angus as a new contact. And just like that, I've added him. And you can see all that data is stored right there. Adding new contacts with Cardhop is super easy. So let's say a few weeks later, Angus calls back and uh, he's got more information for me. This time I'm going to activate card hop with the hotkey, which is control option D by default, but you can change that. And Angus just told me that he's into social media now. So I want to add his Twitter uh, handle to my contact card for him. So I'll type Angus. Now it's figured out I'm talking about Angus. I'll hit a space bar and then type Twitter. And then I'll type in his handle, big bad Angus M. And you can see it's already parsed that out to add the Twitter handle to the card. So I'll hit update by tapping the return key. And I've just updated his card again. But then there's more. Angus tells me he has a birthday. I want to put that birthday in as well. So I'll type Angus birthday. And it was 2-14-78. And now Cardhop has parsed that out to add his birthday to the card. Born on February 14th. Love was in the air. So now I'll hit update. And I've added that to Angus's card as well. As you can see, adding and editing cards with Cardhop couldn't be easier. Not only can the application parse the information out for you, it can even put them in specific groups. And best of all, this all happens in your menu bar.